Well, it's Tuesday, my friends, and you know what that means. It's time to rate the fits, kits, and drips around the bigs in this edition of Show Sauce. Are we ready for this? Yeah. Okay, let's start with uh, the rating because obviously we have to go with the hot sauce scale here, starting with mild, if it's like kind of meh, all the way up to fire, which means, yes, this thing is <laughs> nice and definitely a contender for the June winner of sauce that we will buy at our local grocer and uh, slap a sticker on it. All right, let's start with Jack Flaherty, yes, who is returning from the IL. So I'm going to give you a quick description here. The old Shaq and Kobe shirt, fuzzy drawstring shorts with plaid print, white White ones with socks, energy beads. I took note of that. And the notebook in to go container. Keith, what sauce is this? Mm, this is barely mild. I mean, props to uh, Jay Flair for the Kobe nod. We know he's a mama mentality Kobe fan, but this looks like he rolled out of bed and wore this. He didn't know he was going to be photographed. <laughs> he wasn't trying to swag that hard. This is this is mild barely. Did you call those fuzzy pants? Are they like a terry? I think there was a check. I believe this is a terry cloth, like a like a towel texture. Is that what it was? Yeah. It's cozy. like a yeah, it's I mean, cozy. Anyone it's can beachy. clear that up for us. Yeah, I'm not doesn't go. Like I I I I do like the shirt. I love a vintage uh, graphic tee. <sighs> oh, that's What's a in the serious notebook? sigh. I don't love the notebook. The notebook is notebook. the biggest thing for me. I'm, I'm intrigued by the mystery of what's in all of those pages. Yeah. Baseball notes, it's... journal, diary. He's like, Thanks. people didn't love the fuzzy shorts with the <laughs> Rec, are there hikes? Note to self. <laughs> don't wear this uh, again. Dear diary, they are filming every time we step out of this place. <laughs> This guy, look, he's been on the IL for a while. Maybe he just, you know, he just hasn't been in the game enough. That's all it is. Yeah. He's just trying to get back in the game, working his way back. He's a working man, rolled out of bed, went right to work. He's, you know, I, I'm just going to assume it is definitely uh, more on the mild side for sure. But I, I, I can appreciate that he's got, uh, you know, a hardworking Mamba mentality. Yeah, the combo of the plaid and the terry cloth is what's sort of throwing me because we've got like, like, um, Sort of, you know, Northern England, Ireland with the, <laughs> with the print, and then like Miami with the texture, which is a doesn't yeah. quite work. I don't, yeah, yeah. I, I'm just, I'm confused, but I also don't hate it because we all love Jack Flaherty. Okay, let's move on to our next contender. Yeah, he's a perennial contender, but keeps getting snubbed. He's like our Leonardo DiCaprio here of Show Sauce. <laughs> <laughs> so he's rolling into Minute Maid Park with that black pea coat, the chains, the track pants. Shades hat, um, but in my opinion, what makes the fit? And if we have a zoomed in picture of this, um, it's definitely the blue Louis Vuitton duffel. That thing is absolute fire. We do have. It's like a oh, blueberry yeah. sauce. Yeah, right? Oh, <laughs> like a blueberry jam. Like blue a little hair. blueberry jam it's, it's, on the it's side. Full of blue of hair. It. There's nothing to do with blueberries. <laughs> No, with the sauce. I'm sorry, is he wearing a peacoat in Houston in June? It's like 98 <laughs> degrees there right now. Maybe the roof was closed. I think okay. Jazz just, you know, after the team meeting, he's like, all right, I gotta, I gotta be more serious, right? So he went from in casual London. to business casual. He's got the, the Louis bag and the peacoat, like, suit jacket over the white tee and the sweatpants. Like, if you take the suit jacket off, he's back to regular Jazz, just white tee, two chains sweatpants but he's like all right here's my little pico jacket and now I'm now I'm business casual I mean rec maybe he's so icy he needs the pico to stay warm that's is, a stretch is anybody else and this is weird I, I don't normally do this in like a pair of what someone looks like is anybody else getting like to vibes I don't know why like I see to yeah. Terrell Owens when I look at this I think it's the shades like I really like the shades I just uh, the look with the hat I I like this fit. I, I think it's working. Uh, I do love the bag. I think it all works. I think this is reaching like, you know, medium tangy, getting some, it's, this has some some fire to it. I like it. Yeah, I like oh, it. I'm gonna call it spicy azul. Ooh. That's, that's all I got. You know what? I should just end the show right here because I've given you my best material. Moving on to everyone's favorite son there in Cleveland, Jose Ramirez. Uh, fresh and all Blanco, the chains, the dog tag, and then the Yeezys. That may be the thing that ties the outfit together. Mm. Yeah. Keep it. Well, just because they're expensive <laughs> doesn't mean they're right. stylish. <laughs> All three of them, like the Louis bag is expensive. Maybe those terry cloth shorts are expensive, but doesn't mean they're like nice or good looking or swag or whatever we want to use. Um, I look at this as like, 
oh, it's after Memorial Day. Now I can wear white. <laughs> I'm going to wear <laughs> all everything white. Everything in the closet. <laughs> Yeah, I I don't I like a monochromatic look. I like the all white. I would maybe even like the Yeezys better if the shirt fit a little better. Like we were saying, we were talking about this earlier. It doesn't look like it's supposed to be an out an outer tee. It's supposed to be an under tee. Yeah, just threw it on. It's like yeah. it's fine. You're right. There like there's a certain type of material in a yeah. fit for a white tee that you're wearing. We've gotten as your so much more critical shirt. over time. Yeah, look at us. But I do like. I, so, okay, well, what's like a all? Like, like I have any room sauce. to talk. It's a tartar sauce. It's not spicy. It all and it's all white. This yeah. Is mayo. <laughs> this is mayonnaise. But this is like, yo, know, I can I can pull off this mayonnaise fit because you know what I signed for. You know what I'm worth. Yeah, he's like he's like the really like rich owner that's like, I don't have to care about what I wear. I don't need he's to prove up anything like, uh, to anybody. Tim Cook. You're, like exactly. Steve Jobs. Like, yeah. you know what I'm worth. I don't have to show off for you. Wreck, are you on the same page? I actually page? really like this. Yeah, <laughs> no, I actually really like this look. I think it's great. I think it's him. You know, I got to spend a little bit of time with him, and I think Hosey's just the type of guy. He just shows up like he's 5'9". He doesn't owe anybody anything. <laughs> he's worked his butt off to get here. He's just going to show up in his in his, in his his undershirt, his shorts, and uh, whatever. I don't even know what those kicks are called. You guys said something. Yeezys, I don't know. I'll, yeah. just, I'll just trust you. Yeah, that. Uh, those, They're not yeah, crocs. I, I, I'm not don't, a fan. It's not crocs. what I would wear. <laughs> But I like it. It's a good look for him. Absolutely. This is a terrible take for me to have because I actually wear Crocs. Do you? I love Crocs. You, I, I actually, I'll wear them on the show tomorrow. Oh, we not. never you wear won't. Crocs. I will. I will. I'll you will? I would never. I will yeah. wear Crocs She is going to wear show. Crocs. Actually, my roommate in college, so Crocs like started in Colorado by where I went to college. They had a kiosk in the, like, the local mall, and I bought a pair because they were so comfortable. She hid them from me because they were so ugly, and she didn't want me wearing them. But here's I the thing about them. them. <laughs> if I'm going to wear rubber shoes, they're going to cost like $49.99 or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> Literally the most All comfortable things I've ever them. worn. I Love them. Okay, um, our wonderful guest from yesterday, Corbin Burns. Uh, first day of school vibes, kind of with the backpack, the clean blue pants, the button up, the white kicks, of course, the slick back, fun ponytail. How are we feeling about this? Rec, let's go to you first. I, I love this, and I'm going to tell you why. Corbin Burns, and you mentioned it, new father, three and a half month old. This guy, look. It's hard to get going when you got, you know, the little one doesn't always sleep. You got to get yourself up and ready. It doesn't always work all that well. But I'll tell you what, he did it really well. I like the look, the slick back hair. I love the pants. The pants do it for me. The blue pants, they're not, those aren't jeans. Those aren't like some kind, those are like nice blue pants. He wears them nice. He's got the, I love him. You know, he's dragging the bag. He's kind of got the walk on. It almost gives you like a little bit of a, um, uh, a Beatles vibe. I, maybe not that old. I don't know. But walking down the street like that, I, I just, I love it. I think this is a good look right here. He does look surprisingly polished for a new father. I will give him that. They should use him for the untucked. What is that they're called? The, yeah, what's the untuck? untuck he should it. be an untuck it ad. <laughs> you know, it's like, are you a busy father on the go with a road trip to get to? You need to not bother tucking in your no, shirt. No time for exactly. belts. No, no time for belts. No time for tucking That's a great in your shirt. Yeah, you know exactly. <laughs> I like the chinos. That was the first thing I said. The blue chinos. He pulled that off. He just seems like he's happy. He's excited. He's going to New York. Yeah. And uh, we obviously had him on yesterday, and his son Carter was super clean. So I know. I'm maybe disappointed. Maybe his wife helps them. You know what? Like, I'm disappointed. I think he looks fine, but he doesn't. Now that we know that Carter can, yeah, look so maybe good. his wife could help him. He doesn't look more. <laughs> maybe the wife only does like the, with the sons. Only clothes, does so. Carter's clothes. <laughs> so we need to just hit Brooke up to like style him. Brooke, yeah, Brooke. hey, Brooke. he looks fine. Carter looked better. Brooke Burns, we're looking for you <laughs> to style your husband and get him a show sauce bottle that you can proudly display on your mantle.